So summer is just around the corner, you guys. Yeah. Um, and there's a lot of people, you know, trying to lose weight, trying to get back in shape, you know. You know, they have to get their swimsuit bodies together, I guess, you know. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know what I mean. And um, I can't say anything bad about those people because I am one of those people. Um, back in October of 2012, I was on this huge health kick where I was just eating fruits, vegetables, you know, exercising every day. And then Thanksgiving happened. And then Christmas happened. And yeah, I kind of just gave up, I guess, you know. And recently, the past few weeks, I've been, I'm back on my health kick, been eating fruits and vegetables, exercising when I wake up, sometime in the middle of the day and before I go to bed. And I'm starting to feel better. You know, when you, when, it's true, man. When you work out, you feel amazing. Like, there's pictures on the internet saying, like, I feel so great after workout, said no one ever. That is a lie. That is complete garbage. It's the truth. You feel amazing after you work out. You feel like, wow, you know, you can get stuff done, especially in the morning. If you work out in the morning, oh my God, the rest of your day is going to be amazing because you have the strength and the energy to deal with pretty much anything. I really want to get a bike so uh, I can start riding, around, or riding my bike in the mornings. That'd be fun. I would love to do that. Um... I haven't rode a bike in years. I think the last time I rode a bike, I was like in third grade. It's been that long. I actually had a new bike. I got a, a brand new bike. It was back when I was like in, I think, sixth grade. And I never rode it. When I was younger, I was overweight. I was overweight, overweight as a kid. And I wish I had pictures, but I didn't want to take any pictures because I was overweight. Kind of self-conscious about myself. Uh, this was around like fourth and fifth grade. A little bit of sixth. Then around in 7th and 8th grade, I started losing a lot of weight. And I feel a lot better now. Um, I haven't, what are those, uh, Tums? I haven't had a Tum in like, God, years. I can't even remember. Because I used to have like, you know, uh, chest pains a lot. Sometimes I, I couldn't go to bed because my chest hurt so bad from all the garbage I was putting into my body. And, um... Pet-no-bismol, the pink stuff you have, you know, I haven't had Pet-no-bismol in years. I can't even remember. It's been years, I mean years, since I had Pet-no-bismol. Um, it's been years since I had chest pains. I used to have really bad chest pains. Like, they were, like, it was terrible. And uh, I think the reason for that is I also ate really, really fast. I don't know. I don't know if it's a guy thing, but I used to eat really, really fast. And, um, ever since I lost all that, you know, that weight, I just felt so much, I have so much more energy, you guys, I can't even tell you. And, and people are like, what are the secrets to losing weight? What's that? What's the trick? What's the magic trick? There is none. The only thing you have to do is eat fruits and fruits and vegetables. Make sure you eat plenty of fruits and vegetables. You work out, obviously. In the mornings, at night, or both. As long as you work out, eat healthy. Cut back on all the candy, sugar, ice cream, sodas. Sodas, oh my God, soda is so unhealthy for you. And I had not had a soda in like nine months. Because I, I, I did away with sodas. Um, drink plenty of water. Plenty of water. And cut back on candy, cakes, ice cream. I know it's delicious, guys. I know. Maybe get sugar-free popsicles if you really can. You know, just, you got to let the fatty foods go. Fast food. That's something I really have to work on is uh, stopping fast food. Now, last uh, October, I had like a month where I didn't have fast food. And then it was like, this is hard. This sucks. I'm about to go get some McDonald's. But really, fast food's not healthy for you. Home-cooked, healthy meals are the best way to go. And uh, I'm going to make that commitment right now. You guys are witnessing a commitment from me that I'm going to do away with fast food for the next... Okay, I'm not going to say year. 
you know what? No, I, I was I was gonna say like five months, but I am gonna say a year. I'm gonna do away with fast food for one year, 365 days. Um, yeah, that's gonna be hard, but I I, I know I can. Hopefully, I can do it. Uh, so that that's that's the secret right there. Water, fruits and vegetables, no fatty foods, greasy foods, um, and exercise. That's 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 all you have to do. Um, and I know what you're gonna, I know what you're about to say. Oh, that's just a cliche, you know. Oh, just a cliche. If you work hard and eat right, you'll lose weight. Exactly. You know, um. Shay Carl says it all the time, and if you haven't seen my Shay Carl impression, haha, <laughs> go check it out. Two hundred and something views, right? Shay always says the secrets to life are hitting behind the word cliche. The secrets of life are hidden behind the word cliche. Because people say all the time, "Oh, that's a cliche. That's a cliche." Exactly, because it works. It works. People don't want to believe that cliches actually work you know um study hard and you'll be you can be whatever you want to you can be whatever you want to be that's a cliche exactly because if you do work hard and and you are committed to what you want to do you'll become what you want to be i cannot tell you man how easy it is to just to be happy, I guess. <laughs> this went from weight loss to happiness. And I, I tell you, man, I, Shea Carl was an inspiration to me. I love him to death. And if you haven't, you don't know who I'm talking about, uh, search Shaytards. Yeah, man. Shaytards vlog every single day. Fun family. It's a fun family to, to watch. Yeah. So about cliches. They're not just called cliches. They are the secrets to life. They're hidden behind the word cliche. So, yeah, I mean, uh, I'm telling you, and, uh, <laughs> this video, oh my God, I'm not even going to edit anything out or I'm not going to try again because I may have, you know, screwed up on things I should have said a different way or whatever, but I'm not even going to edit it out. I'm just going to keep in the video. And if you guys think I look stupid and you're watching my video, so you're stupid. I'm just kidding. Uh, you're beautiful. You're beautiful. I, I like your, I like your dress. What's that? You're not wearing a dress. <laughs> yes, you are. You're beautiful. <laughs> but um, back. What was I talking about? Weight loss. And you know what? I, this video. I mean, I, I'm pretty much done uh, with this video. How long am I doing? Eight minutes. God, I can talk. What do I need? I need to shut up. <laughs> but I'm going to end the video by just saying, if you want to look great for summer and have that perfect body, eat right, plenty of water, exercise, no fatty, greasy foods. That's all I'm going to say. And you feel so much better. That is the whole point of this. Is you feel so much better. And, uh... Uh, that, that's pretty much it. Yeah. <laughs> um, you're awesome, and you should know that. See you later. <gasps> what?